Hey guys, Psychic Pictures here, and welcome back to more Pokemon Coliseum. In the last episode, we fought Dakim. And in this episode, we will be going into the Dreaded Under. Now, there's something a little interesting about the Under. Uh, hold on, let me check something real quick. Aha! Okay, so you might be wondering, wait, why are you in Pyrite Cave and all the way over here? Well, there's actually something we can do. Uh, I'm sorry that we're not going to get to the under in this episode. We'll be getting to it in the next episode, though. Uh, but this is something I completely forgot about, and that roller boy actually jogged my memory. Check it out. I'm Miracle Bee. I'm Mir Bee's rightful successor. Going to t going to get me an afro. We have a boss fight here. Miracle Bee. And he st he's starting off with Linoon, level 39. Headbutt, Roar, Protect and Flail. And Electrode, level 39. Explosion, Light Screen, Protect and Spark. I kind of thought he would start off with his Electrode, and I want to finish that thing off as soon as possible, because I don't want it to get off the light screen. Yep. <clears throat> I'm not going to finish it off this time. But I do like this music, though. It's awesome. Hopefully I can finish it off with, uh, Mistrevis, though. And his main strategy here is getting that uh, light screen up and having their his Pokemon barely hang on and then use Flail. But luckily, the Electrode does not have Flail on it. So, at least there's that. But it does have Spark, which is going to do a lot. Or not. But this is a completely optional battle, you don't have to do it, but every single trainer that is required on this path, you have to fight again. It actually took me quite a while to get back up here, even. Alright, level 40 for Espeon, and level 40 for Mistrevis. And then he's sending out Sea King, level 39. Waterfall, Horn Attack, Flail and Protect. I'm not sure what to think about this battle because I honestly am doing this for the very first time. Um, I think I'm going to cast up a Reflect here and um, heal off that Paralysis from my Espeon. Because I need Espeon for a portion of this match. Uh, I'm going to try and use Espeon for as much as I can and then uh, switch out to Feraligator. Oh, good, Lightning hurt itself again. Seeking uses Waterfall, hopefully this doesn't do much damage. And it didn't do as much as I thought. Uh, let's take... Let's go and take out that Seeking. Because <laughs> I am a little bit scared of that Seeking. Uh, a little more than, um, Lining, though. Oh, gosh, if he uses Flail. Headbutt. Alright. Alright. Waterfall. Good. Didn't use Flail. At least we have that. Let's start attacking that Linoon and take out that Sea King. Alright. Boom. Oh, jeez, if it uses Flail. Shadow Ball on Sea King, that'll uh, take it out. Alright. Uh, I actually recommend that you go and do this battle if you're 
uh, playing along with this Let's Play um, because it gives you a lot of experience that you would be missing out on because this is only between Dakiem and the next um, person we're going to fight which I'm not going to spoil who it is Psybeam uh, and Psybeam Psybeam Oh! I forgot to read Sand Slash's moves Sand Slash level 39 Protect, Flail, Slash, and Aerial Ace so we take out that Linoon. I'm surprised he hasn't used Protect at all. He has it on all his Pokemon. And his last Pokemon, Pseudo Wudo. Level 39, Flail, Protect, Mimic, and Self Destruct. And I knew Espeon wasn't going to survive that. That since there's two rock, uh, rock type and uh, ground type on the field, for alligator can finish them off. So, yeah. Mr. Trivis uses side beam on Sudowudo to soften it up, and then for alligator should use surf before the other two. Hopefully, yes. So sand slash is definitely going down. I'm not sure about Sudowudo though. Yep, barely hangs on. Sandslash didn't have a chance of surviving that, though. Confused. Hopefully... YES! It hurt itself. Mir Miracle B is done. Didn't last as long as I thought it would. My dreams, you ruined my dreams of getting an afro. You collect a lot of money from that, though. Darn, I don't care if no one agrees, I'm still the rightful heir to Mir B. Even though my hair hasn't grown to, to a full afro do. Is there anything else here? Nope! So I'll meet you guys back uh, at the bottom of the pirate building. Pirate building. Okay, now that we're here at the bottom of the pirate building, we will be going into the under. We will just be doing the regular stuff, though. You can actually avoid that chaser by hugging the wall. So, she will be battling us. And every time you go over here, she will challenge you. Amphion by Brava. I should have had my Gur Alligator up front anyway. He's falling behind in levels. Um... Well, he's not falling behind, he's just one level behind. So he should have. Oh, come on. That Amphion's gonna use Flail, isn't it? Mischievous. Take down. Boom. It knocked itself out. Wow. Okay. Good job, Chaser. <clears throat> Side beam it. Side beam. Boom. Boom. Yeah. Now Mr. This is my strongest Pokemon, even though it was previously. Uh, okay. This didn't happen. Alright. No matter what, this elevator's off limits. Except if you have a key. I'm just switching around my team just in case. Because I don't exactly remember what to do with this. Elevator key. Yeah! 
This elevator is off limits. And we have entered the under. The under. It's a marvelous place. Full of bones and skulls. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. It's time for the under time again today. Without further ado, let's bring out our that special someone we've all been waiting for. Lady Venus, please. Hi, everyone. It's me, your Venus. Everyone's Venus. That's me. I have something terribly important to share with you today. It's horrid. There are spies right here in the under. Can you imagine? Don't. We don't really know all the details, but if you see anyone suspicious, please let us know. Everyone, please, I'm counting on you. We don't... We need you to get lots of information for us. And that was Lady Venus. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, thank you for watching. Please do tune in again. No way. They know that we came here already? Psychic, we're going to have to be cautious. Well, with you acting like that, we can't. Hi. What's the holdup? It should be here by now. Okay. Bye, kid. There's actually a specific trainer that we need to talk, uh, battle. We get three hyper potions here. And over there you can actually have a lemonade machine that you can you go by going all the way around. That you can get to by going all the way around. Sorry. Bye, Rui. Really. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it's time for the under time again. Lady Venus, please. Hi, everyone, it's me, your Venus. Everyone's Venus, that's me. I'm very disappointed. The spies haven't been, haven't been caught yet. Can you imagine? Everyone, please, I'm counting on you for more cooperation. And that was Lady Venus, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Thank you for watching. Please do tune in again. Okay, the spies haven't been caught. That's good. But, this is the trainer that we need to beat. Alright, da da da, yada yada yada, the winner of the Colosseum gets a Shadow Pokemon. So yeah, there is a Colosseum in the Under, but we won't be able to get to it until the After Story. Magikarp and Feebas. Okay. Actually, actually, oh! Sorry about my stupidity, but I completely forgot that, uh, there is something else that we need to do, and this guy doesn't come into play until much later. Waylord! Oh gosh! Fear my serve! Boom! Boom! Fear my surf. Splash. I love that sound effect. <laughs> and slash on Waylord. I need to take that Waylord out because it's a threat. Rah. Die. Ah. I said die, why don't you die? Splash! Splashy! Surf, oh gosh. This is gonna hurt. Boom! Actually, it didn't do as much as I thought. That did a lot less than I thought. Slash, Phoebus. Beat bass. Oh, oh, that hurt. No, uh, I stick my tongue out at you. Slash on Phoebus. 
I would have splashed you to death. No. Ugh, oh, gosh. Yeah, we beat him. Even though we shouldn't have fought him in the first place. So, shut up! You're not gonna get a shadow Pokemon in the Coliseum like with that team. Holy crap. Hello, person. Ah, sheesh. What What should I do? I have to make a delivery, but I'm still not clean, done cleaning. Oh. Hey, wait. Wow. Aren't you Psychic and Ruby? Huh? How do you know who we are? I thought so. This, this makes things easy. Please, can I get you to deliver this part to next house? Obtain the power-up part. But, wait! Just tell Nate that it's from Peter. He'll tell you the details. Next house is the one with the big rotating antenna dish. You'll know which one it is as soon as you see it. Yep, we've already been there, though. And somehow, Rui and me switched places. Venus, what is your situation? Well, a couple mice appear to be running loose, Nascor, but it's nothing to worry about. We'll catch them right away, pulverize and mash them up. <laughs> Fine, the priority is to distribute Shadow Pokemon, don't forget. And as for you, Ein, hurry, complete the Shadow Pokemon's development as soon as, you po as, soon as possible. Your trust will not be misplaced, Master Nascor. Already, sufficient Shadow Pokemon battle data has been gathered from our minions. My masterpiece, the most powerful Shadow Pokemon in history, shall soon be ready. Good. I will be waiting for good news. That is all. Now, it is it is time we return to the lab and put the finish put on the finishing touches. Come, back to the lab. Yes, sir. Hmm. I wonder what's going on. The most powerful shadow Pokemon. Huh. I wonder what it could be. Hmm. Well, we'll be going and seeing next. You brought me the power-up part from Pierre? Great, I was waiting for that. Huh? Are you... are you... THE Psychic and Rui? Oh, wow, this is too awesome. Come on, you have to go inside. Quick, quick! What's going on? Why are we so popular? Meg, Ned, you won't believe this. We won't be you won't believe who just dropped in for a visit. We've got some shocking company. Shocking company? Try not to be too shocked when you hear it. It's Psychic and Rui. No, really? Bit, is that true? Is, th is that Psychic really here? <laughs> See for yourself. Hi. Hi, I'm Net. Second Pyrite told has told me all about has told me about what you've been doing so far. Handed over the part. Oh, this is from Pier? Great, this is this is all I need to get the kids grid back up and running again. It appears to be an SPC. I better explain. A little while ago we somehow lost access to the kids grid. We think it's caused by some jamming signal that's interfering with the kids grid. It's probably Venus is doing. But this power-up part you delivered will let me boost up our equipment. When we get the kids grid back up, I'll try to hack their computers for useful data. Well, okay. Oh, Psychic, please wait. May I have your PDA number? We'll contact you as soon as we discover anything. Gave the PDA number. Thank you. We'll do our best to gather useful information for you. All right. The spy! We spotted the spy! 
Uh oh. I didn't do it! <sighs> Where's the place to save?